Law? Huh? Oh. I thought you were deep in prayer. No, I was awake. It was kind of like I was dreaming, though. I daydreamed that my dad beat Wishy-washy. I think it's time for me to come clean. Look, the truth is, I know exactly- What? You- No. I crammed it in a drawer and- Why would you do that to a memento of- I did it because it's a memento. Everyone here misses him. They want another amazing leader just like him. But I'm not ready for that. All those expectations have turned into a burden. Oh. So is that what you meant when you said the ring's too heavy to carry around? Yeah. It was my dad's prized possession. Wearing it makes me feel like I'm taking on his whole legacy. I realize Nath is in a better position to take over dad's legacy as a leader. I, I had no idea. I'm sorry, Law. I didn't know you were struggling like that. It's fine. I should have said something. Maybe I just wanted to push all my struggles onto someone else. That daydream of getting beat up by my dad. So what will you do with the ring? I'll go talk to Nath. I can't keep making other people... Law, it's good that you were able to see your father again. Even if it was just a dream. I guess. We got in a fist fight, but that's just like him. Or just like the two of us, maybe. Nath, are you free? I, um... It's about Dad's ring. Oh, that? You left it lying around in here, but I put it somewhere safe. Huh? I didn't just leave it lying around. It's fine, just take it already. It's your ring, right? Right. I won't ever let go of it again. Is it still heavy? The ring, I mean. Kinda, but now I understand. I'm all- There's no way now to know what Dad would've wanted. I just have to do whatever I can. Yeah. The law I know would never bother to think too deeply about something. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? <laughs> Looks like he's overcome his worries. What was he even worried about anyway? If he didn't stop being so indecisive, I thought Zephyr might come back from the dead to beat some sense into him. <laughs> I wouldn't put it past- Uh-oh. He'll hear us if we talk too loud. Anyway, don't get yourself too worked up, Law. He pretended not to notice, but I'm pretty sure Nath knew I was worried about something. That makes sense. He seems to know you really well. Yeah, though well, maybe he knows me too well. It can get kind of annoying that I can't hide anything from him. Not much I can do about that, though. After all, he's known me since I was a little kid. I haven't known you as long as he has, but it sure seems easy to understand what you're thinking. Oh yeah? Then what am I thinking about right now? Hmm... That you're hungry? Who do you think I am, Shion? No! Actually, I was thinking about how I need to take good care of this ring. For both my dad and my mom. Definitely. If you ended up losing it for real, we'd have a seriously hard time finding it. Not only that, but I'm sure Zephyr would be furious. Oh, he was. Huh? Nothing. You don't have to worry, though. I won't let go of it again. Yeah, I can tell. Do you think you're ready to wear the ring now? I think so. It seems smaller than when my dad had it. Maybe you've just grown into it.